Hello, my name is Richard Tellman of RTFJ Jewellery and I'd like to introduce to you our new range of encapsulated memorial jewellery called With Me. With Me is a timeless collection of rings and pendants that allow the ashes of your loved ones to be hermetically sealed within a dedicated chamber of the jewellery. The entire process of encapsulating the ashes of your loved ones can be witnessed and that is the process I'd like to show you here today. So this is the pear-shaped pendant called Maya of our range and it's within the pair of this shape of this pendant that the ashes are going to be encapsulated and this is the part that I invite all of our clients to watch so they can always be assured that the ashes are within. So the rear of the chamber of the pendant is hollowed out and it's within this chamber here that the ashes are inserted. A very very small amount of the ashes are simply tapped into the back of the opening and once the ashes I put within the chamber, we just seal a back plate over to the rear of it. So this part of the process is soldering on the back plate. The soldering process will allow it to be hermetically sealed from within. This is now part of the process where heat will be applied to the pendant and the solder will flood all the way around the gaps and seal the pendant entirely. Please be assured that the uh, manufacture process of any piece of jewellery is, uh, is very rough and it always will be finished off beautifully. So now that the, the solder has sealed the back in place, we now just need to leave this to cool for a while before we give it a very minor acid treatment to remove the oxides before sandpapering and polishing. So this part of the process is removing all the excess solder and smoothing out the back plate so that the piece looks like it's never been touched. So now that all the excess solder has been removed, as you can see the piece is now completely sealed and it's starting to take shape. The final process of the piece is to use two different grades of polish to get a luster finish. And here is the finished pendant, completely smooth, completely polished and a timeless memory of your loved one. So now I'm just going to cut in half the pendant just to show everyone the unaltered ashes that are within.